So upon entering, we're going to have guests um, call us. This is a sign Headline Salon and Spa has been waiting to put out for several weeks now. It's time to open it back up because if we don't, we're going to lose everything. Marsha Miller and her daughter, Christy Goldby, have been in business for 35 years in Yuba City until the stay-at-home order put everything on hold. We went from one day making lots of money to the next day making absolutely nothing. So it was, it was scary. Up until Friday afternoon when Sutter and Yuba counties put out a revised stay-at-home order welcoming hair salons to finally reopen come Monday. These are happy tears. <laughs> the Bi-County Health Officer is also allowing places of what they consider to be the lowest risk of exposure to reopen, like shopping malls, dine-in restaurants, gyms, libraries, and parks. But churches, schools, and movie theaters must stay closed. And she felt it was important uh, to the health of the community uh, for a local order like this. An ability to um, um, get as many people back to work as possible in a safe manner. They say their case rate has plateaued and they have a minimal number of hospitalizations. Our community's done a great job flattening the curve, just like the rest of the state of California. All businesses that do reopen must develop their own list of safety protocols to protect their customers and employees. For Goldby Salon, that means limiting the number of people that can be in the salon at the same time, and clients can only come in for 30 minutes at a time. We're going to trust that we're all doing the right thing and just be good team players. 